something in my past is the key to all of this. One of the things we see in the movie, going back to the memories of Carol, are the things that, you know, the things in life that pushed her down and she literally got back up. Do you have things in your life that you are conscious of that you plowed through to make you the person you are today? And of course, being an actor means like you get knocked down sometimes three times a day and you gotta get back up. That's a huge part of my life and who I am and it's a huge part of why I feel Mm, like grateful and resilient in a way that in the moment when you're getting knocked down it seems like why is this happening to me but now you know a, after a decade of it a decade later I'm so grateful for it yeah it's amazing the things that in the moment you feel a certain way and then you're like but look who I am now yeah but that takes time too I'm 29 now and I feel like I'm just at the point where I'm starting to have a new relationship to my memories and that couldn't have happened before it's just merely because of time you've come a long way as strong as you think. We see that in Carol in the flashbacks, the things that literally knock her down in life and she gets back up from. What are the things in your life, Sam, that have knocked you down that you've been able to get back up from? Oh, them being black? <laughs> uh, that would be... A stutter, um, economics, uh, segregation. I grew up doing segregation in Tennessee. Um, lots of things. My, my drug addiction, I mean, a lot of things have been in my way. Yeah, I figured out how to get back. You figured out how to get back. Yeah. You're now the most bankable star movie star in Hollywood. I think you figured it out pretty well. Thank you. One of the themes in the movie for certain is things that have knocked her down in life and she's gotten right back up from. Um, what are some of the things in your life, Gemma, that have knocked you down and you've gotten back up from? Well, I think any time that you initially don't succeed at something. And I think it's a really important lesson to learn early on as a, as a child, even when things didn't work out the first time or if I didn't do quite as well as I, I hoped, um, but to not let that put you off. You know, and it's better to try and fail um, than to not try at all. Like, you know, disappointment is a temporary thing, but regret lasts forever. So it's better to go for it.